Llama? I was just gonna check on you. Are you done practicing already? No, I never even got started. Oh no, why not? Because my friends have all these really cool things to ride for the derby. And all I have is my regular scooter. If I want to win, I'm going to need something more. Don't worry. We'll figure it out. And if we can't fix up your scooter, then we'll find something else, okay? Okay. Maybe we can fix this up. No, I need something cooler. How about this? I need something exciting. Like my scooter, only bigger and better and faster. Hey, what about those? Hmm, maybe they could work. Now be careful and try to balance. Hey! Nope, definitely not right. The derby's tomorrow and I've got nothing to race with, so there's no way I can win. Hmm, you can't forget to have fun because that's the most important thing. Don't think about winning. Think about finding something that works so you can be part of the fun. I guess you're right. I'll keep looking. <gasps> Mama, I've got it! Oops. Sorry, Llama Llama. I didn't see you there. That's okay, Mama. Llama, why are you walking and talking like that? Are you okay? More than okay. I'm just trying not to bump my loose tooth. I want it to fall out on its own, when the tooth decides it's ready. Well, we don't want to rush your tooth. Right. And when it falls out, I'll put it under my pillow when I go to sleep and see if I get a surprise. Don't worry, sweetie. You'll get a surprise, just like I did when I was a kid. It's one of my favorite Llama family traditions. Now let's look at that loose tooth. It looks like your tooth already fell out. What? Mama Llama, please don't joke about such a serious thing. I'm not, sweetie. Take a look. Oh no! You're right! My tooth is gone! Where could it be? Where? I'm sure the tooth is at one of the places we visited today. We went to Nellie New's house. And Luna Giraffe's house. And Daddy New's bakery. And don't forget the park. My tooth could be anywhere in the house. Or in town. Or at the park. Oh, I'm never going to find it. Oh, never say never, Llama Llama. If we retrace our steps to all those places we've been today, we'll find it. You think? Absolutely. And we'll have fun doing it, too. Ready? Operation Fine Llama Llama's Tooth begins now. We'll look here first, since you were in your room this morning. Here, toothy, toothy, toothy. Maybe you're under here. I don't think my tooth's in my room. <sighs> Right. Hmm. Let's go check the kitchen. What if we can't find my tooth? Then I can't put it under my pillow. Oh, I really want my tooth. Don't worry, dear. We've only just started. It's time to take the search outside. Huh? Uh, what? Too cold anymore. I thought I heard a sneeze. Did I hear a sneeze? Just a little one. I think I'm all better now. Your forehead is still a little warm. You still have a fever. Hmm. <coughs> I think we need to give it one more day before you go back to school. Plus, we don't want any of your friends to catch the cold. One more day? Oh, but today's the carnival! I'm sorry, sweetie. I know you've been looking forward to it, but you're just not well enough yet. But I... really... feel better! <coughs> Why don't you come to the kitchen? I'll do everything I can to make you feel better. Okay. Mwah. All 
right, Mama. Good. So here we go. Mama Llama's patented family formula for getting over a cold. A nice warm bowl of noodle soup, a big glass of orange juice, and some slices of super juicy grapefruit. The best way to get over a cold is sleep, soup, and citrus. Sleep, soup, and citrus. Mmm, warm and tasty. <laughs> Cold and sweet. <laughs> Sour and squirty. Hey, you're right, Mama. I feel better already. <coughs> <laughs> Did you have a good rest? Yeah, but I wish I was at the carnival playing games and tasting Daddy New's super yummy snacks. I love those snacks. Me too. All of Daddy New's snacks and cakes are really good. And I bet they're good for me. They'll help me get better. Maybe I should go to the carnival right now and have some. There's still time. Come sit with me, sweetie. If I let you go out while you're still sick, it would only make you sicker, and it would take even longer for you to get better. And we don't want any friends to get sick. Do you understand? <laughs> But resting doesn't mean you can't have fun. It doesn't? No. In fact, we can rest up together. <gasps> Ahoy, Mama! I see land far away, but uh-oh! Here comes a big wave! What? And a big sneeze. Hold on, Captain Lama and Sailor Fuzzy. Here's the wave. Yay! Our bedship is safe. <coughs> Good job, Captain Lama. <laughs> now let's sail the ship to land and home where have a snack? <laughs> I hope I'm all better tomorrow. Me too, Captain Llama Llama. <laughs> Next year I'm going to the carnival for sure, even if I'm sick. Even if I have to sail my bed there. <laughs> hmm. Good morning, my sweet llama. Do I still have a temperature? Not anymore. How are you feeling? <sighs> so much better. I guess it was good I stayed home yesterday and rested. I think so. Okay, sweetie, it's a brand new day. Get up when you're feeling strong and awake enough. <laughs> <laughs> well, looks like you're feeling strong and awake enough. How about some breakfast? Meet you in the kitchen. <laughs> One more, just to make double, triple sure. I'll get it. Hello. Hi, Lenora. Oh, no. You sound awful. Oh, that really doesn't sound good. Well, I totally understand. If your voice is hoarse, it's going to be very difficult for you to sing. Feel better. What happened to Lenora? Well, Llama, I'm really sorry, but unfortunately Lenora has the flu and won't be able to play at Graham's birthday tomorrow. No! Hello? <sighs> yes, I just talked to Lenora. I'm sorry you're sick too. And your other guitarist? Right. Mm. Okay, feel better. Oh no! It looks like most of the band is sick. 
I don't think we're going to have a band at the party after all. But I want Grim to have her favorite song played at her party by a band. Oh, I'm so sorry, Llama. But we have other things planned for the party. But I really wanted there to be a band to play music. She was so excited about it. What are we going to do? The party is ruined. <sighs> mm. It's OK to be upset, Llama Llama. I understand. I'm not happy about the way this turned out either. Maybe we just shouldn't have the party. Well, Graham certainly wouldn't want us to cancel the whole thing. We'll figure out something great, don't worry. Every time a plan changes, Little Llama, it just gives us a chance to do something else. Really? Absolutely. Even though we don't have a band, it doesn't mean we can't have music. We could play Graham's favorite song on an old school vinyl or a CD. What are those? <laughs> They're ancient technology, but they'll play the kind of music we're looking for. But can we find Graham's favorite song to play? I hope so. Come with me, sweetie. Okay, here are some older albums. We've got A Tribe Called Llama, Hoof and Oats, and even Alpaca Bambada. Do any of them have Graham's favorite song? Mm. No, they don't. <laughs> Maybe I should just perform Graham's favorite song for her. <gasps> Wait! Maybe I should perform Graham's favorite song for her. What a good idea. I bet we can put together a band and sing for Graham. Yay! Let's do it! We're gonna make a band, and it's gonna be grand. <laughs> yeah, we are. <laughs> There's only one little problem. <sighs> What's that? Well, you can sing, so that helps. But I don't really play anything except the bells and the pots and pans in the kitchen. Okay, every band needs bells. Plus, I bet we'll find something else for you to play. Oh, good! Now we just need the rest of the band. 